Okay, so I'll show you how to get into the website. Um, so first off, all you do is go to the website, saskedfest.ca. <clears throat> It'll load up, it's fairly quick. Uh, as you can see here, it's just all the boxes. A lot of them say coming soon. Uh, some of them do have some information. We can change that. I'll show you how to do both. So first off, how to get into the website to edit. There's this little hidden Stormtrooper helmet. All you do is click on him and you put in the username and password. And I've already done that. What I'll do is I'll send that to you uh, in the email so you can just put it in and you're gonna get this page. Um, just double click on the STA Festival Recovered and you'll see it pop up here right away. There you go. Uh, this acts kind of as a website too so you can click on it and see how it functions. It's a little bit slower. Okay, there you go. So uh, right here on the left hand side is a list of everything that we can change. Everything that's actually in these boxes. So for example, if I want to change uh, schedule of events, I just find schedule, and click edit, and it just acts as uh, basically like a blog. If you've ever done a blog, uh, you'll, you'll recognize a lot of this or any word processing. Uh, you'll see pretty much the same thing. You can add things like videos and, and uh, pictures if you want pretty easily. Uh, so, for example, here I had, here's a test. I'll put coming soon, testing, and I'll just hit OK. And then what you can do is, you should see that come up right here. Okay, and so you might be saying, okay, well, what's with this blue line? This isn't exactly how it'll look when you go outside of the back end. So what we'll do is we'll just go back to the site, Sasked Fest and click on it and you'll see this is how it actually looks so there you go that's all you need to do um, again back in the it's called content manager because we're actually just managing content all of these boxes have one of these uh, what i can do for example i have uh, pre-conference and we can go into edit okay um, Sometimes the spacing acts a little weird, so you might want to play around with the spacing. Just maybe add uh, extra spacing, um, etc. I've already done this one. I can just hit OK and click on it, and you'll kind of get a sense. These should all scroll. So this, yeah, doesn't look correct. Uh, it'll just throw out all the information we have in there, but when you actually get to the website, it will scroll like that. And that's kind of how it's designed. So when you're done, you don't need to do anything. Just uh, you can close out of it, and uh, if it's not working on the website, just hit Control R, and that will reload the web page, and uh, that's all you should need. That'll let you change everything on the site.